So let's just jump to After Effects and show you a quick thing in here. The biggest feature in After Effects, and this is our, our visual effects and animation program that people just love. What we want to show you here is something called the Roto Brush. So okay. you've probably heard the term rotoscoping. You guys yes. probably use it here, yeah. right? So rotoscoping would simply be, he's not on a green screen background. I need to cut him out. Yeah. So the job is to zoom into the edges of his hair and draw very carefully around each frame. So we need to take him and cut him out of the background. And to do that, we're gonna use a brand new brush called the Roto Brush. And this really is, it's a remarkable brush. Um, it works just like a regular brush in, in Photoshop where you change the size and you paint on the screen. But watch, all I have to do is paint from the top of his head over to the shoulders like that, let go, and it finds the rest of the how does he? How does it know that? <laughs> And it's, it's, the other cool thing is, see, there's a little error in here. I'll just yeah. click in there and it fixes that error. And I can change the size of the brush, click over here. And what it's doing is it's, it's making an overlay, if I want to look at that, or the actual mask. And it's doing it over time. So if I drag this back a little bit, you'll see that it will now figure out over time. So as he's moving around, it's cutting him out, so to speak. Absolutely. And then we can refine the edge on the left hand side. We've got something ref called refine mat. And when we zoom in and click on refine mat, it's going to intelligently look at the edge of his hair, treat that different. If there's motion blur, so if my hand is moving fast, it will really softly uh, rotoscope that area inside. I can't even imagine how much time that would save. Oh. It's like hours or days. It, it is. And when we've shown this to high end users in Hollywood, that's exactly what they said. You've taken two days' work and you made it five mouse clicks. So, I mean, you talked about high end users. But what about just someone that's kind of an enthusiast? I mean, he could use something like this as oh, well. Oh, yeah, absolutely. He or she. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. And that's why we create production premium. Because people don't just edit video. They edit video. They add motion graphics in here. They need to clean up a background. Because production premium includes things like Photoshop and Illustrator. So it's really all the tools that anyone would need, pro to an enthusiast. Well, I want to thank you so much for showing this. And I know there's like 100 more features. Where can people find out more information? Uh, they can go to adobe.com and download a trial version. Colin Smith from Adobe talking about the latest Creative Suite 5, the production premium bundle.